What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys part 7 for my playthrough on Pokemon Legends Arceus for the Nintendo Switch. So guys, in the last episode, we got started with the Cabot Coastland, unlocked Basque Legion, and collected two new Pokemon for our team. And in today's video, we're going to be climbing up Fire Spit Mountain and defeating our third noble Pokemon. You guys already know the deal. If you do enjoy the content anytime, make sure you support me as a content creator by leaving a like on today's video. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, get on top of that. Subscribe to the channel. We got tons of new content coming along the way, so you guys do not want to miss out. But let's get started here. Start walking up Fire Spit Island. We're at a volcano, and it is raining. It's actually pretty cool. It's actually pretty cool. But we're going to be finishing up the Cabal Coastlands. Also, in today's video, we're going to be finishing up this noble Pokemon battle, exploring this little Fire Spit Island, collecting a few new Pokemon, and then heading all the way across this... Uh, lake river ocean whatever you want to call it to a brand new area and catching a lot of new pokemon and hopefully making or uh getting our four star rank and getting to a brand new area but that's the goal say that's the goals we got plenty of goals but look at our team y'all i didn't even forgot about our team yo we got a bunch of new pokemon in the last episode we got gumi and we got basculin to add to our team and we evolved koala into his swimming typhlosion so we have four out of the six pokemon for our squad so basculin or basculin is already level 44 so we can't really do anything with him we're just gonna let him be but we're gonna be using gumi and trying to get Gumi level up and all that good stuff. But there is a Magmar early on here, and I kind of want to catch it. So you know what? Let's fight it up, yo, and use our Hisuian Typhlosion, because this thing's sick. Look at this thing. He's so sick. He looks so sick. I love him so much. I love him so much. So we're going to use Hex. Nice little ghost stab move. He is now ghost and fire type, which is amazing. And we're going to bring Magmar down to yellow. And yo, what? Flamethrower looks sick in this game. It looks so sick. Let's throw a great ball at this thing. Add Magmar to our Pokedex. You can actually catch Magmar and Magby in this area, which is absolutely amazing. But come on, yo. Let's get this. First try. Let's get started off on a strong note here. Let's go. Let's go. The game knows. Game knows. He's just like, all right, yo. Jeans is recording. Let's let him get started off on a strong note. But there it is. Magmar to the squad. Let's actually pull out Magumi here. Just get him levels and use that on him. But who's hitting me? Is someone hitting me? No, I thought a Pokemon was hitting me. But if we make our way up here, we got a lovely little wisp. A lovely little wisp, and I'm going to be collecting all these because, like I said, I want to do 100% playthrough on this channel. So right now, we're just crushing the main story, and then after we get done the main story, post-game, we're going to be collecting or going backtracking, collecting a bunch of Pokemon, and doing all that good stuff. So let's collect that. See if there's any new Pokemon up here. I would love to catch something new. I see a Graveler. Hmm, I really don't want to go up against a Graveler. I'm kind of just looking for a Magby. There is Magmars, but I'm looking for a Magby. I know Magbys do spawn here. Not worried about the Magmars too much. Let's keep rolling here. Bunch of, oh my lord, everyone's a Magmar. I'm out of here, yo. Get out of my face. Not dealing with you. We got Iron Chunks. Cannot really do much with that. But yeah, Magby spawn there. Hopefully, we find one in, on our way back here. Let me actually get this Iron Chunk. Let me get the, ooh, almost went into the lava. <laughs> almost went into the lava. But let's get rolling here. And I'm going to actually lead Typhlosion here because I know there is going to be a battle up here. But as you guys recall, in the last episode, we have uh, these chicks over here. I forget what their name. They're something sisters. They took one of the Growlers from our main character, from the Pearl Leader, Arita, I think her name is. And we're here. We're getting it back. And then after this, we got ourselves an amazing, probably one of the, the better noble Pokemon battles, just because of how cool it is in the area that we do it. We do it at a volcano, so it's so cool. It is really, really cool. But here we go. Let's get home with these guys. Let's get after it. Let's get after it. I want to battle all three of you. I want to battle all three of you. So this one's going to challenge me. The Bandit Clover challenges me to battle. And who should lead? Abomasum. Oh, dude, that's perfect. I got Hisui and Typhlosion. This thing is going to light it up. He's going to absolutely light up. Dude, he looks so sick. Looks so sick. And I think we have Flamethrower with this dude, right? Yeah, yo, this move looks so sick. We just saw Magmar use it. Bro, dude, that <laughs> looks so sick. <laughs> that looks so sick. We absolutely dump on that thing. Fire is four times super effective. And we're going to get a big bulk of X XP here, right? Obama Snow, gotta give us a lot, right? Make it happen. Let's make it happen. Make it happen. Look at that. 1,400 for a Typhlosion. We get a nice level up. And uh, the two Pokemon can evolve the Starly and uh, Star Ravia. But we don't really care about them. Actually, might evolve the Star Ravia just to get Star Wrapped around Pokedex. But that's what I should be doing. With the empty slots that I have that are not my uh, team that I want, I should be using it to level up other Pokemon and have them evolve in there. But we're gonna challenge the other sister right here. And she's gonna throw out a Toxic Hook. Okay. Toxic Actually, yo, fighting moves can't hit us anymore. We're ghost typing. Oh my lord, dude, that's awesome. I love the new Hisui form typings. I think it's very, very cool. We're gonna start here. I could go for a uh, a hex if I want to. 65 power, or this would actually work better. Unless I want to go for strong style. But regular style, we're just gonna rock out with this. Drop a lovely little flamethrower. Chip up a lot of damage. Give me a burn, too. Throw me a burn. Nope, but this thing's going into agile. I swear, if this thing gets two turns, I'm gonna cry. Mud bomb. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This thing's rocking with mud bomb. Takes out my boy. Can I bring out my dude? Can I bring out Gumi for the win? I think we're just going to stick with Cleaver here. We have Aerial Ace. We can tee off on it. So 
I'm with it all day. I am with it all day. Let's run it up. Let's run it up. Aerial Ace is going to pop here. Yeah. Hey. Get that thing out my face. Get it gone. Get it gone. We actually might have to use our Basket Legion here. Because the Noble Pokemon is a Fire and Rock type. So we're going to need something that's four times super effective to take it out in one shot. So Basket Legion might have to come out here just to do some work. But there we go. Level up for Starly is level 36. God dang, Starly. We might just leave that Starly in here for the rest of the playthrough. See what level we can get that Pokemon to. But yo, dude, that Gengar looks sick. That Gengar looks so sick. And I always forget you can uh, actually throw Pokemon on your side to actually pull them out. But it seems you always oh, gonna throw out Rhydon. Mm, I don't really like that. I don't really like that. But yeah, I can throw out Pokemon on my side just like in the open world and, and see what they look like, which is pretty cool. So we might have to do that for Typhlosion. But Rhydon's gonna come out here. Oh, what do I want to go for here? I could go for Silverwind. I might want to do it. Can I get an Agile? Mm, no, Agile shot really not gonna do much. But we're just gonna go for a regular shot here. See how much damage we're gonna do. Can we do at least half of this thing? Mm, let's see what this dude's gonna use. Rock Slide. That's super effective. Please don't kill me. We eat. That's lovely. That is lovely. He gets two. What is going on here? This thing gets two turns. Why does it get two turns like that? Get out my face. Gumi, let's get after it. Oh, wow. We're down two really good Pokemon. We're down re two really good Pokemon. The basket might have to come out here, but yo, my boy Gumi over here. Gonna rip up with a strong style water pulse. Get this thing out of my face. Get it, Gumi. Get it. Take him out, Gumi. All day, baby. Gumi. Yo, Gumi's ripping. I cannot wait to get this thing leveled up and have a Hisuian Gujar on our team. Dragon and Steel type, what more can you want? He's gonna end up bringing out Gengar, and Gengar's definitely gonna rip on me. Look at it. Just going first already. Using Hypnosis. Put me to sleep, no problem. And that's actually probably a really good combo in this game. Is to get somebody with Hypnosis, rock out with an Agile style shot, put him to sleep, and then do damage like that. It's looking really good, right? Alright, yo, Bastion, can you do work here? We do have Crunch. But will this thing obey me? That's the question. Because I think we're only th uh, three star. So. I don't know if that thing will obey me, but if it can, it will take this thing out, no problem. What do we go for? Crunch or uh, Crunch has higher accuracy. We're going for strong style Crunch. Rip up with it, Basky. He's loafing around. Are you kidding me? He's gonna need to eat this up. We eat up. How long is he gonna loaf around for? That's the real question. Oh my lord, none of these dudes will obey me. Come on, yo. He puts me. Oh my lord. This is what stinks, yo. This is what stinks. Let's go here. Let's go Crunch. He's too drowsy to move. Are you kidding me? Then a shot coming out here. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. Okay, we're gonna need uh We're gonna need to revive some Pokemon here. So we're just gonna use Star Ravia and Starly to just use revives. But yo, that's so stupid that I call it level 44 Bastion and I can't even do anything with it. I cannot even do anything with it. But let's go here. Let's go into items and Pokemon. And where's my revives at? We have five. Okay, cool. I was gonna say, do we have any revives? We're gonna revive his Suey and Typhlosion. And we don't get after it that way. We recover Typhlosion, and what's this thing going for? Hypnosis, that's fine. Put me to sleep, waste my turns. I'm going to start healing out my Pokemon. I'm going to do that. I'm going to go here. Back to items. Uh, do I potion first? No, we're going to we're gonna, we're gonna gonna revive Cleaver here. God dang, Basculin, dude. I really want to use him up against this uh, Arcanine. I really want to use him up against this Arcanine. But there he goes. He takes us out there. Let's bring out our Starly, and let's just heal up our Pokemon now. And just pretty much just guarantee us to win for this battle. But yo, dude, this Gengar's giving, doing us dirty right now. This is Gengar totally doing us dirty. Going to our potions. I have better potions, don't I? I do indeed. Indubitably, I do. Give this to my boy. And Starly, stay in here. Go for Hypnosis, man. Then a shock later, Starly. All right, Starly drops out. Um, We could just bring straight out our... Oh, what's it called, right? Typhlosion? Or do we bring out Cleavor? Let's bring out Cleavor. Let's bring out Cleavor here. Hopefully Cleavor outspeeds here, does he? We're dead, dude. We're gonna get ripped. We're gonna get ripped here. God dang, Gengar's ripping up onto us. Because we're not even gonna be able to heal up our Pokemon here. Our Basculin totally screwed us over. Watch, dude, this thing just outspeeds me, right? Or do we go first? Oh, we do go first. And we get two turns. We get two turns. That should be GG's, right? That should be GG's, right? We only need it one. We only need it one. Thank the Lord, man. Thank the Lord. My boy Typhlosion comes in there, rips through, and takes that thing out. And what I want to actually do is grab another water Pokemon that we have. Because if Basculin cannot hit up on this noble Pokemon, we're going to need somebody else. We're going to need somebody else. But yo, dude, that thing ripped. That thing ripped in. That thing laid into me. No problem, dude. He was just ripping. Slapping one shot, one shot, one shot, one shot. Thank God my Typhlosion came in clutch there and ended up winning it for us. But there it is. There's the Arcanine that we were trying to save. We finally get it back. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. But 
after this we actually unlock a fast travel point to right here so i can actually fast travel back to the camp get all my stuff heal up my pokemon and kind of just fast travel back here and then get going with the noble pokemon i cannot wait to defeat this thing and get going on uh with the next area not the next area of the game the other spot for this area there's a bunch of new pokemon over there and it's just so cool considering there is a super cool pokemon that you guys are going to not want to miss out on a lot of po people want this pokemon really bad it's actually a super rare pokemon so i'll show you guys the exact location but i'm actually almost done this game on my stream playthrough so if you guys haven't checked out my stream head down in the link in the description below jeans 25 on twitch name is right below the face cam and we're doing post game stuff over there so i'm gonna have guides up on this youtube channel very very soon on where to get the starters at where to get rare pokemon how to do a bunch of different things but this growth over here actually evolves into his suing arcanine his suing arcanine is so sick rock and fire type and look how sick it looks it looks like it's wearing like armor it just looks dope all around i think it's a really cool pokemon if i didn't take his suing uh Cyndaquil or his suing typhlosion on my team in this playthrough i definitely would have rocked out with his suing arcanine because look how cool he looks i just think all the his suing forms are really really cool I really do. I love them so much. But our team's coming along just fine. The next area, we will get our fifth Pokemon. And then I think the area after that, we will get our sixth and final. But I cannot wait for the Pokemon in the next area. Because I think he's super, super cool. I think he's super cool. But here is our next noble Pokemon that we have to defeat. His Suey and Arcanine. Look how sick he looks gold. All decked out gold? This dude's looking tough. This dude's looking so tough. This dude's looking so tough. But look at us just chilling in front here. But... Like I said, they're going to give us a little break. They're going to allow us to heal up our Pokemon, which is very nice. Thank God they did. They allowed us. They, we just first some very hard Pokemon. And the battling system is definitely totally different in this game. Like, you can just get steamrolled by one Pokemon, like a Gengar. He's just so fast, and he hits like a truck. He's just always constantly going, constantly going, constantly going, without anybody else getting a turn, you know? And there's no such thing as items in this game, so you can't put on, like, a Focus Ash. You can't do any of that stuff. So the battle system is definitely totally different, and it's easily sweepable with the changing of move styles from agile to strong it's just sometimes we'll get the best dude probably the people who have this game have been playing and noticed that y'all getting one tap left and right what is going on here what is going on but it just happens it legit just happens you either be one tapping or you are getting one tapped in this game which i mean it's all right there's no rank battles in this game so it kind of just works for this game but i cannot wait for gen 9 i feel like gen 9 is going to be a perfect mixture of old pokemon games with the gyms and all that stuff and the leap four mixed in with this game and they have to implement a lot of things for this game like the effort levels instead of EVs and IVs is perfect. Um, the catching, the wild areas and all that is money in this game. So if they implement that with the old Pokemon games, it, it'd be over. It'd be over. It would be over. Because what, what I'm thinking about this game right now is this is just the beginning. This is like their first little trial here. Even though this game is phenomenal. This is their first little trial at going after a game like this and making it, making it open world for a Pokemon game. And it's working beautifully. So next game, they're going to perfect it. And it's just going to be absolutely amazing. But like I said, we can now fast travel back to the camps. So I'm going to fast travel back to the camp, heal up my Pokemon, and uh, bring out a different water Pokemon out of here. Out of my out of my box. Just in case we need it. Because ba I don't think Basculin is going to... Uh, go, he's just going to be loafing around the whole time. So I could go with Sveal. I could go with Mantike. Who else? I could go Gastron. I might just go in with Gastron. Gastron's really good. And it's a second evolution. I don't mind a Gastro. I do not mind a Gastro. Gastro might be it, or we can go in with you. Water and flying, but he does have rock moves. But I think my boy should be faster. What level is this thing? 32. Gastron's 32. Um, you know, I'm just gonna go in with Gastron. Gastron just seems like the better choice here. So let's switch Gastron out for you, and we shall get rolling here. Let's get rolling. Do I need anything? I could craft some Pokeballs and put some items away. Because after this, we're gonna head to a different area. So you know what? Let's craft some Pokeballs. 13 of them. And we'll craft some more Ultra Balls. 11 of them, beautiful. And do we need revives? Might as well. Might as well. We got some materials for it. And we'll craft some more potions. We don't need, we need more medicinal leaks. So we definitely got to get after that. Okay. Cool. Cool. And I'll put some stuff away from my box. Because, you know, I hate having a full item thing. I hate having full items. This is awful. Oh, wait, these pop pods. Uh, these, these roots. What else do we want? These mud balls. Actually, I'll keep the mud balls out. Smoke bombs can go. Smoke bombs can get out my face. Stardust will keep, I guess. And what is this? This scatter bag. We'll need that. Okay, cool. Good. We good? good Rossberry, you can dip all right let's roll out now let's roll out let's go defeat our third noble pokemon in the game on fire spin island but this is the area i was talking about that we have to explore the full-blown area over there we definitely go rip it up get some new pokemon on the squad or not on the squad in the pokedex which is amazing and then get moved from there because there is a few really cool pokemon like i said there's a super super rare pokemon over there super rare pokemon hopefully we can catch because only only one of them spawns so if it runs or we don't catch it it's gonna be tough it's definitely gonna be tough but this noble pokemon battle over here it's actually kind of tough. It's definitely tougher than the other ones. Because you're in a small, confined area. You guys will see in a second. 
He looks sick. Walking through the lava? Oh! My dude! Yes, sir. Run it up. Run it up. Run it up. Run it up. But, yo, it's same old, same old stuff over here. We're going to actually uh, try to get our gash down out here. Uh, where's he at? Where's my gash down? But this thing is actually pretty crazy. So he's going to do these uh, thing right here where he blinks his eyes and then uh, does like a dive. So we got a dodgy shot. So there's his blink. We're going to roll out to the side. That did not hit me. Get out of my face. So we're taking damage already. We should be fine here. Oh, gee. I'm getting ripped. I'm getting ripped. I'm getting ripped. This is actually, like I said, it's a tougher battle. Dip over this way. We just got to play this one slow. Keep throwing these bombs at him. Dip over this way. And I want to actually bring out my Pokemon here. I'm going to actually switch over to my Pokemon. Roll over this way. There we go. So now I can switch back to my bombs. And what's this thing doing? He's just running around in circles. So let's just keep ripping him up with bombs. And he's going to do this thing right here. And when he charges that, you have to hit him how many times he has the fireballs on his head. To actually knock him down. And then he can throw out a Pokemon. So we're going to throw out a Gastron. My Gastron should just be able to one-tap this thing, which is, should be lovely. Let's get it. Let's get it, Gastro. It's going to use Crunch. Can you eat that? Beautiful. Love you, Gastro. Love you, Gastro. I'm going to be able to do this. I'm just going to be able to go for a strong style shot here because it should be able to one-tap it, no problem, right? I'm going to heal my Gastro after that. But there we go. Some big damage popping out on this thing. Did it kill it? I did not. I didn't one-tap it. Whack. And we go down. God dang it. We need something else to speed this thing. We need some... Wow, dude. I really thought Gastron was going to be able to work. Who's going to be able to outspeed? I'm going to guess Cleavor, right? Or we can just throw out Typhlosion. I'm going to throw out Typhlosion. Typhlosion should be able to outspeed it. Actually, I probably should have thrown out Cleaver. Nope. That's a good choice for me. Well, it's going to pop here. I probably should have went for a strong style, right? Did I even go for one? I think I did anyway. But there we go. We knock him down. Let's do this. And let's just throw bombs at him. And then after that, just heal up my boy. And we're going to wait for him to dive, but I want to heal up my boy, like I said. I got to heal up this Gastron. Gastron could be really beneficial for us. Where are my revives? Go here. Switch it down there. And I can't believe we weren't able to one-tap him there. That's super whack. Where's my potions at? Potions, use these, and get one with that. We'll give him two, because we need him to eat up some shots. All right, come on, dude. What's he going to do? He's jumping up in the air. We're going to dodge that, and we're going to keep throwing bombs at him. And what he actually does is he throws this thing right here. He does this... uh. He throws this, what's it called? This fire thing right here. I have to get out this way. Oh, my lord. Now, look at this. He's in this middle area right here, and we can't really do much with it. I can actually roll through him, which is awesome. Try to lead him this way. Dip this way, and we're taking fire damage, which is awful. And look how close we have him to killing him. Roll out this way. Come on, yo. Keep throwing these bombs at him. Keep throwing these bombs at him. Dip. Eee! We're so close to this fire, man. Keep throwing this at him. Keep throwing, and he goes to this other side. And which is a, what's a pain here is you have to just like snipe him from this far. Can I hit him? There we go. We're hitting him from here. There we go. Keep hitting him. Keep hitting him. Come on. There we go. That should be game. We got him. Yes, sir. Run it up. He was doing work to us early on in the beginning there. He was definitely doing work on us early on. He hit us like his first three shots, but we were able to actually just like counter him and learn his mechanics and all that stuff. But that's what a lot of these noble Pokemon are. The first time you reverse them, you have no idea their moves or what they're going to do. Like this dude charged at me right off the rip, and then he did a jump attack right off the rip and hit me with both his moves. But once we learned it, we we're like, okay, let's get after it. But that's exactly why I said uh, this Pokemon is definitely challenging. We have a combined space. We were sitting there. He put a flame in the middle, so we couldn't move out of that little area. Like, I'm not, I can't walk across the lava. Unless maybe I can ride on, like, Earth Ring or something and get across there. But maybe, maybe not. But, yeah, we were just stuck in that little confined space right there. And it was awful. It was awful. So we were just dodging, dipping, dodging, dipping, dodging. Throwing the bombs and eventually getting a kill, which was awesome. But there we go. Defeat our third noble Pokemon. And look how cool he looks. He's so sick. Like I said, if I didn't have uh, Cyndaquil on the team, we'd definitely rock him with him on the squad. He's looking so tough. He's looking so tough. Really, really tough. But guys, oh, yo, there's another one up there. But let me know in the comment section down below. What starter you guys ended up picking? Because I think they're all super, super cool. I think they're all cool. But it's also very cool that uh, there's a Hisuian form for the three main types. Say there's there's a grass type, new Hisuian grass type, there's a new Hisuian fire type, and there's a new Hisuian water type. So say you don't pick the other two, you get the other two typing in a new in a brand new Pokemon. Because you got Hisuian Arcanine. You got Hisuian Electrode and Voltorb, who I think is really, really cool. And then you got Basculegion. Like, come on, man. That thing is so sick. Cannot wait to bomb my Basculin and rock out with him on team. Because a lot of these are same Pokemon, new forms. But there's a few new Pokemon. Like Cleavor, Basculin, uh, Braviary is not a new one. Who else is a new one? Is there any other new ones? Or are they all forms? Uh, Weird Ears new. Who's cool? Psychic and normal typing. I'm trying to think. So you got Cleavor, 
Bashu Legion. Hmm. Bashu Legion. Uh. I think Sneasler is brand new, technically, right? It's like a new evolution to Sneasel. So maybe, can you still evolve into Weavile in this game? Can you have Sneasler and Weavile? Because usually when they're new form, they're called the same Pokemon. You know, it's called Typhlosion, but it's Hisuian form. But it is what it is. But yeah, a few new Pokemon. I just think I just think they added really good Pokemon and really good forms in this game. And I think they did it kind of perfectly. I don't think they needed to add any new Pokemon because it's not a new gen. I just think they sprinkle a few newbies in there, sprinkle new forms in there. You got yourself a great game like this. But yo, Gen 9, when Gen 9 comes out, they're going to have some bangers, dude. They're going to have some bangers. And I'm waiting for them to make like a like a regional form on Excadrill because Excadrill is one of my favorites of all time. He's just super, super cool. But I cannot wait for that. But did he heal my Pokemon? Actually, my Pokemon already healed. But there it is, yo. Defeat our third level Pokemon. Now, our next mission is to head all the way back to the... Uh... Oh, yo, wait, there's a Magby. I didn't catch the Magby. But our next mission is to head all the way back to the... What's it called? Let's see if I can throw him a berry. I'll head all the way back to Jubilee City and cash in our uh, mission with Commander Kamado. No, you don't attack me. I gotta catch this Magby. I gotta catch this Magby. Do not attack me. Catch that Magby, please. But chill on me, man. Chill on me. I gotta fight this thing. Gumi, get out there. Gumi, get out there. Do we get this thing one-on-one? -on -one? Please get this thing one-on-one. -on -one. God dang it. We don't get this thing one-on-one. -on -one. Magby, no, Magby, ran! Get out my face. Poison gas coming out here. Come eat that, because I don't want you to die. Oh, he's just poisonous. We're running this one. Magby, die. Get out my face, dude. I really want that Magby. I really want that Magby. But like I said, our, our next mission is to actually just head back. Is there another Magby anywhere? Just to head back and go to uh, cash in our quest. But we want to go catch some new Pokemon and add them to our decks. Because we have to be uh, star level 4 anyway to actually do anything. So we might as well head to the new area and catch a bunch of new Pokemon. So let's go do that. Let's go do that. And we're going to head right over there by just hopping into the water with our weird ear. Switching right to Basque Legion. I absolutely love that. I absolutely love how we can just switch. But yeah, we got Tentacool over here. I don't think we have a Tentacool, right? That, that's not even a... Uh, can I catch you? Can I catch any of you guys? Nope. We're going to have to fight him. Uh, let's switch to my... Switch my Cleaver here. Cleaver coming out here. We're going to catch this bad boy. I don't think we have a tentacle yet. Oh my god, yo, there's three here. We got to run. I'm running. I'm not fighting three tentacles in a tentacle. Like, <laughs> we're just going to get ripped. They're definitely more floating around here, so we'll just do that in the meantime. But I'm going to hop up here. Switch to my Gumi. Oh, there's an Alpha Gashadon, which I do not feel like dealing with. Look at that thing. Look at that thing. I think it's just a pain. He's huge. I'm out of here. Oh, Luminion. I catch you. Yes, back shot with Luminion. I don't think we I think we have a Finian, not a Luminion. But I'll catch another one just in case. Let's go. Luminion caught level 44. God dang. Come here, Finian. I catch you. Alright, there's a hit on that. There's a cool fish over there. Another Luminion. Like, do we already have Finian? We do. Okay, but that's second caught, which is really, really good. I kinda wanna head back to the tentacles, man. Definitely need him for a squad. We have an iron chunk up there, and there's the tentacruel. Hope we can just catch it. Come here. Oh my god, we didn't catch that one. Catch that, please. Oh my god, I can't hit these things. They're so annoying. They're so annoying. All right, yo, let's dip out. We'll catch one on the way back because we're going to have to come back anyway. Up here. Oh, there's a tentacool. Come here. There's another batch I can try to get. Sneak, 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 sneak. Why are they dipping like that? I can't hit him. I cannot hit these dudes. It's so hard to catch Pokemon on the back of Bashkill Legion. So, you know what? We'll, we'll get them later. Let's head over to this little island. If we see more, we'll definitely go for it. There's more. Hold up. Oh, no. These are cool fish. I have a few cool fish. There's an alpha cool fish as well. Oh my God, dude. I can't catch any of them. I can't, I'm just wasting Pokeballs. I'm, I'm done with catching these water Pokemon. I'm done. I got to be on an island, and I got to catch them all off the coast. Only way. Only way. So, let's hop up here. Any, any floating over here? Oh, Octillery on the water. On this side, I'm going to catch you. Oh, you son of a biscuit. I'm coming up here. We're fighting you. I keep wasting so many Pokeballs. No, get up here. I want to fight him. Can I throw out my Pokemon? Oh, dude. Hey! Chill on me. Let's throw out, uh, let's throw out Star Ravia here. No Star Ravia action. I just feel like it's our best bet. Water definitely does its dirty in a few situations. But I'm going to go here. I'm just going to go for a quick attack. Level 42. I probably should use a better move here. 
We might be able to go twice because of that. Ice beam. Oh, we might be dead. Later, Staravia. God dang. God dang. But yeah, yo, the water Pokemon are definitely a pain to catch. I'm going to throw out a... Uh... Ooh, I'm going to throw out Cleaver here. It's tough. Do I just throw a Pokeball at it or do I... Or do I hit it? I'm going to have to hit this thing. I'm going to go for an Agile shot. Agile really won't do anything for us. None of these moves. I'm just going to go straight for a Silver Wind here. Normal shot here. Hopefully, we don't kill it. I don't think we should. Yeah, beautiful. Bring it down to uh, yellow, and I'm, he's going to Water Pulse probably can me, right? God dang, man. We're just getting ripped. We're just getting ripped. But I have to go into these other Pokemon. We'll start Bashkin. I want to throw Pokeballs at this thing. So we're just going to constantly be throwing some Pokeballs at this thing. Getting ripping up with it. But I think like the rest of this video is basically just going to be us catching Pokemon. Trying to get the next star rank. So let's do it. Let's just keep grinding. That's what this game's about. Catch this thing, please. Catch it. Lock it in. Ah! What's this thing going to go for? Char- This thing just have every move to KO me? Does this thing just have every move to KO me? That's nutty. Why does this thing have every move to KO me? Get out of my face. Catch this thing, please. Catch it. Ah! I can't do it. I can't deal with it. Hydro Pump. Missed. Thank you. Bashkin, throw another one. We're catching it right here. We're catching it right here. Let's go, Pokey Gods. I need you right here. Catch me this Octillery. Things being a pain. Add it to my decks. I don't even think we have a Ram Raid. Let's go! Finally caught that thing. Dope, dope, dope. Uh, I actually might go head back and heal my Pokemon up. Which I think I should go do. We cannot surf here. We cannot uh, fast travel there. But it's not a far trip once you get on Bash Legion. You can legit just like rip through it. So let's do this. Let's heal up the Pokemon. And let's go back. Let's go back. We might even just take like the... We, we might not even fast travel. Actually, fast travel could be the play because we could find another Magby. You know what? We're going back up to the Molten area. Back to Fire Spit Island. We're going to head down there. And if we see a Magby, we'll definitely catch it. Or at least we'll try to catch it. There's Magmar. Give me a Magby. Magbar. No Magby. God dang it. Where's my Magbys at? None of them spawning. I think they're a higher chance of spawning. Or a lower chance of spawning. That's what I meant to say. So, let's just get grooving here. Let's just get grooving. We know Magby's there. We'll definitely add to our Pokedex another time. But we're making our way back. Maybe we'll go for Tentacle. Maybe we'll go for Tentacle again. But, we're going to hop over here and just get rolling. I see some tentacles. Come here. Pop up. I hate these things. I, I can't, I'm not dealing with them. I've been wasting so many Pokeballs in trying to hit these tentacles. I think you have to, like, get on the coastline and feed it uh, food or something. What is that? That's a Finian. No, I'll catch you. Just have some fun. I'm out of here. <laughs> hit it with a back shot. We gone. Let's go right up to this water over here. And we got more cool fish. And did we even catch that thing? Oh, there it is. We caught it. Nope. I had tentacles. Come on, yeah. Is this the play? Yes! Yes! Maybe we gotta hop and do it. Can I catch it, please? Let's go! Maybe that's what we gotta do. Is there any tentacles here? There's a few, but there's they all see me. Now we can make our way towards this land and look. Look, guys. Empoleon! Empoleon is chilling here, which is dope. What is this? Oh, we got Celio. Here, dude. And a Walrene. Is that an Alpha Walrene? Can I catch that, please? No, no catch. Let me pull out my Great Balls for this thing. Is that an Alpha Walrene? Are you Alpha? Come here. You are not. You are not an Alpha Walrene. Oh, we definitely catch that in a little bit. That is not an Alpha Walrene. We could totally catch up on that thing. But I'm going to go here. I'm going to go right here and uh, switch to my Gumi right here. And I'm going to travel down here, see if there's anything new, and then head back. Oh, Walrene, can you leave me alone, dude? I'm trying to dip away from you, dude. There's a wisp over here. I'm trying to dip away from the Walrene so we can go catch it. Where's he at? God dang Walrene. <laughs> Tell me, Walrin. I know you don't see me. I know you don't see me. Stop. You don't see me. You don't see me. Is there a way to, like, just, like, hide and have that thing, like, not see me anymore? That thing will rip up on me. But you know what? We'll just dip over. We'll come back from. We'll come back from. But as you guys can saw, see over there, there's a Alpha Empoleon chilling there. Alpha Empoleon. So we can come back there later and actually get it. But if we head up here, sometimes the boy spawns. I'm going to hope he's spawning. There's a Golduck. I see you, Golduck. Toxicroak. I don't think we have Toxicroaks. Maybe I'll sneak up on this Toxicroak. See if we can add to the decks. Um, I feel like he likes honey, right? Everybody likes honey. Get this medicinal leak. I'll stand still here. Please don't see me. I hate this game, dude. I legit do not like this game. If I head over here, to Golduck, please don't see me. Please don't see me, Golduck. I'm in the bush. I'm in the bush. Yeah, yeah, I'm in the bush. I know you don't see me. We'll feed you a plump bean. I don't know if I have a Golduck yet, so I'm going to catch it anyway.
Eat up. You, you don't want that? Get on my face. <laughs> Back shot there. And Polyon's chilling, dude. And Polyon says it. Can we catch that? Let's go. Golduck. Is that a first one? That is our first Golduck. Lovely. Here's another Golduck. I kind of want to catch him, too. He's right here. Might as well hit him with a back shot. Oy. Might as well hit him. Grab his medicinal leak. Could catch three gold ducks if I want to. Could catch three. Grab this. And there should be like a little pond over here. Can you turn around or something? Can you turn around. Oh, he's going to sleep. Night night. Bob. <laughs> Get in the Bob ski. Please stay in that Pokeball. He does not. He does not. And there's another wall ring. I should go catch that wall ring. Let's try to catch these wall rings here. Definitely want to catch these wall rings. God dang it. Why is it raining so much? Oh, he's sleeping. He's sleeping. Give me a sec. This will be our best chance to catch him. When they're sleeping, just hands down the best chance to catch him. Because look how green that is. That was not a back shot. Are you kidding me? How is that not a back shot? Please catch it. Let's go. Walrein added to the decks, baby. Added to the deck. So like I said, we're going to get a bunch of new Pokemon over in this area, which is exactly what we're doing right now. Exactly what we're doing. And what is that down there? What's a Murkrow? Do we already have a Murkrow? I think we have a Murkrow. I think we have a Murkrow. Switch to Gumi, get the XP for that. And just keep moving here. Keep on moving. Keep on moving. But there is a cool Pokemon that spawns up here. I don't think he's going to spawn right now. Maybe we need the times to change. And I would love to come back here and try to get him. He is so sick. Oh, I threw a Pokeball there. I want to throw Gumi and get all that. So let's go over here. There should be like a little pond, right? Yeah, this pond up here is where he spawns. So let's go see if he's chilling up there. Please, yo, please be chilling up here. I really want to show it to you guys. I didn't want to show you the, the dude. What is that? Is that a barrel? Oh, <gasps> wait a minute. There he is, guys. Look straight ahead. The boy, Piplup. My boy, Piplup. But barrel, I'll talk to you in a second. Please don't attack me, barrel. We're on a mission to catch this Piplup. Only one of them will spawn here. So if you mess up, you have to restart and go somewhere else. So we're gonna go for a back shot here on this lovely Piplup. Come here, stay still. Stay still, Piplup. Let's go. Come on, yo. Give me that Pip-Up. Give me that Pip-Up. I don't think we have a Babiro either. <gasps> no, we gotta fight it. Come here. Come here, Pip-Up. Come here. Do not run. Do not run. Do not run. Do not run. Pip-Up! Oh, my lord, dude. Can't believe we didn't catch that Pip-Up. But if you guys want to catch Pip-Up, he's right there. I'm gonna catch Babiro, though. I think I need him for my decks. Come here, dude. How did we not catch that Pip-Up? Perfect back shot, too. Perfect back shot onto the Pip-Up. This thing's gonna each crunch. I don't care if Star Ravy goes down. Arabia's fine if it goes down. It's not a big deal. I'm gonna go for an agile shot. Maybe get two turns. Oh, I get two turns for Carlos. It's amazing. Bear slash coming out here. How much damage are we doing? We can hit him again with this. We can hit him again with this. Bring him down to red. But dude, we didn't get that pip pop. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. I know where Turtwig's at. I know where Pip Pop's at. I wanna catch them both. And I know where Chimchar's at too. We can actually go catch Chimchar's. We can actually go catch Chimchar's. But let me bring out my Gumi and catch his Babiro. Dude, I can't believe we didn't catch that pip pop. You might wanna. You might want to uh, reset the island. Come back to it. Could be really good for us. But I'm just going to keep, keep catching Pokemon. Need to get my levels up as well. So we'll just keep doing this. We need to get our star rank up. We need to get our Pokemon levels up. So catching Pokemon is definitely the best way. So we catch him. I can't believe we missed out on Pip Up. And there's an area right here, up here, which I don't think you get to unless you have a Sneasler, which is a climbing Pokemon. I can go here. Let me switch to uh, this. I don't know if we have a Toxic Group yet. Great Toxic Group. Turn around. Uh, what do you want? I'll give you a cherry berry. That were over his head. It goes that way. Go, go eat up, dude. Yeah, cherry berries all day. Munch, munch, munch. Happy birthday. There you go. And with that Pokeball, hopefully we catch him here. That'd be a lovely little catch. Of course we don't catch him. Of course we don't catch him. Let's get a move on. Let's keep on. Yo, chill on me, dude. My boy's chasing me. I wonder if there's more barrels over here. Let's slip around, see if there's any newbies that we gotta catch. Toxicroak, I still think we have to catch. We need some medicinal leaks. Definitely need him up here. Up off you. He's my Gumi. Keep getting XP with him because he doesn't evolve to level 40, which is nuts. Which is nuts. We got a Mammoth. I'll actually catch that. Please do not see me. No, you don't see me. Thank you very much. Let's see if I can just smoke this thing with a Pokeball. Great ball from deep. Kobe him. Come here, dude. Kobe. Up. <laughs> Get this nice little Peppa Plant. Peppa Plant and medicinal leaks are where it's at. Definitely where it's at. Catch that Mammoth, and I'm actually gonna fight this one right here. Just keep, just get my Pokedex up. I just heard, what was that noise over there? It sounds so familiar. I can't believe we didn't catch a pip up. I'm super upset with that. We're going to a flamethrower here. Drop this thing. Get out my face, Mammoth. 
Give me your XP. Give me your XP. And this could be a great way to level up my Pokemon. It's by ripping up the 3's Mamas. Definitely could be good. Level 41 for my boy. Awesome. And yo, 1600 XP. That's lovely. Oh, that's an Alpha Mama. Yeah, we, we don't want to mess with that. Do not want to mess with that. I'm going to run through here. Actually, grab me this Peppa Plant. Dodge that. And then uh, keep moving on here. So here you go, Gumi. Gumi, keep getting XP, man. Keep getting all the XP. More Mamas here. I'm going to fight that one. Come here. Come here, dude. Run it up. Run it up. This game's so much fun. But, yeah, we're ripping. We got a bunch of new Pokemon today. We missed a Magby and a Pip Up, which could have been really good for us. But we can head to brand new areas and get new Pokemon, which we might do, considering I want to uh, record for another at least 15 more minutes. At least 15 more minutes. We can get a lot of other stuff done. I do have to catch that Toxic Croak. There's one right here, too. Let me catch this one. Come here, Toxic Croak. We've been having bad luck with Toxic Croak, man. I wonder if we... I don't think we have one yet. I hit him. I hit this one. Oh, we just caught one. Awesome. We just caught one. And that was our second one caught. So we've been wasting a bunch of Pokeballs on them. Let's see if Piplup spawn again. I doubt it. Ah, dang Piplup, man. But yeah, Piplup spawns right at this lake right here. You guys want him? He spawns right here. So I might go to sleep and come back here and see if he spawns again. Because I would love me another Piplup. I would love to get me a Piplup on the squad. Let me go catch Chimchar. I know exactly where to get Chimchar at. So I'm going to actually go here. And then uh, we still have to catch a Ramoraid. I'm going to actually switch to daytime. I'm going to switch to daytime. We're going to go catch a... We're going to go catch a Ramoraid, a Tentacle, and try to see a pip up spawning. And then head to a different area. Go talk to Commander Kamado and get our next mission, which is going to be get four stars. And see how close we are. Let's see how close we are to actually getting that. But more Pokemon than Mario. So let's go head down here. Let's go catch a bunch of Pokemon. Go catch a bunch of newbies, yo. We did catch Octillery, which is great. There's Glamia. We caught one. Feels we call it. We call it a Celio. We call it a Walrein. Bunch of new Pokemon to the Pokedex. Let's get a move on here. Look for a Ram Raid, though. Look for my Ram Raid. Where's my Ram Raid at? Mr. Ram Raid. And of course it's raining, dude. Why is it always raining here? We don't want it to rain here. And I'm looking for you, Ram Raid. Is there a Ram Raid here? Yeah, there is. Right here. Hi, Ram Raid. He's so hard to catch. You know, we're just going to do this the old-fashioned way. Run it, Ram Raid. Run it up. Catching the water Pokemon are such a pain. Oh, there's two. I got to run. I got to run. Oh, dude, he has Charge Beam. We eat it up, but still, it's weird. It's all offensive stats are raised. They're low level, man. I'm running from this thing. I, can't, I hate battling two Pokemon. <laughs> it is all, but I'd rather just uh, can't go catch one, reverse one. Come back, Gumi. Yo, there's plenty of Ram Raids in this, in this thing. God dang, like, here's one. Come on, Star Raid, yeah. Let's do it. Rip up, Staravia. Let's get it. This thing, oh, this thing's only level 22. I'm just going to hit it with a quick attack. Better not kill it. Yup. Awesome. Good work, Star Raptor. <laughs> Good work, Star Raptor. And these Ram Raids are definitely super easy to catch, but they're a pain because they see you every time you move. They see you every time you move. But toss this thing over out here. Yo. My boy was just like, yeet, right off Basket Legion. Toss that thing. This should be a light work catch, right? Thank you. There's our first Ram Raid. Can't believe we didn't catch a Ram Raid before. Add him to the decks, though. Add him to the decks. Do 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 do. So we need a tentacle. I'm gonna go try to catch Pip Plup. And we'll see if we can actually uh actually I wanna get this rock right here. I'm gonna get this rock. And we can take a shortcut to the other side of the island. Keep doing this. Let's do this. And can I actually just uh hop up here? And I just wanna get that Viva choke real quick. But it's so nice being able to switch that quick. Oh, there's a man team here. I would love to just hit this thing with a Pokeball. Oh, I threw my Pokemon out at it. Dang it. Never mind, we're running. I want to catch it. I want to catch it. It's kind of whack. All right. It is what it is. So now he notices us. I want to catch it. I meant to throw like a regular Pokeball, but we'll take a shortcut back to the tentacles through Tidal Passage. We shall get moving. Moving and grooving. So tentacles, where you at? I'm going to have to do like a hop up. We have a tentacle. There's an oh, Alpha Luminion. Jump over him. We're not dealing with that. Heck nah. Heck nah. Where are my boys' tentacles? Where are my boys at? Where are the dogs? Here's one. I don't know if that thing saw me. Yes. Catch it, please. Catch it. Let's go. We got it. Okay, cool. So, tentacle done. Hopefully, the pip-up respawn. Let's go see. Go check it out. It, may, it might. It might not. I don't know how that works. I don't know how, how that works. Celio's on the board. He's back. Let's keep moving here. 
If he didn't respawn, we'll definitely get him another time. Here's some gold ups. Can I see my boy Pip Pop set the water again? Pip Pop? Pip Pop, no! No! My boy Pip Pop is not here. Oh, no, he is! Pips! Pips! Yo, leave me alone, Mabiro. Don't make me kill you. If you hit me, I'm gonna kill you. Yo, what's he doing? Leave me alone. Pips. Yo, we, we gotta give him the finest berry. What berry do you want? A leper berry. A leper berry. Yo, leave him alone. Let him go. Let him go. Babiro, that's not for you. That's for Pips. Pip up. Eat up. He's not eating. Back shot. I'm still catching him. Come on, yo. Get him. Catch him. Yes! Piplup add him to our thing. That is absolutely amazing. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Do we see if a Magby spawn? Might as well. Let's go see if a Magby spawn real quick. And then we'll head back to Commander Kamado and uh, keep moving on with this game. I would love to catch a Magby, but yes, dude, we got Piplup. I know where Chimchar's at. We could go back and get Turtwig, considering we messed up on the Turtwig catch as well. Gravelers, no Magbys. I don't think any Magbys are here. Any Magbys? Nope. Not one single Magby. Get on my face. Get on my face! Not one single Magmi. That's awful. So let's just fast travel back. Let's dip out of here. Actually, let's get this rock real quick. Actually, I, I'm just fast traveling. Screw the rock. Oh, there's a, there's a wild Pokemon. Season. God dang it. All right, might as well get the rock then. Oh, no, but shaking. I don't want to get the rock. Actually, is it shaking? No, it's not. Cool. Give me the rock. And can these guys stop seeing me so I can actually leave? Who sees me? That's the real question. There we go. No one sees me now. Let's get head back there. We're going to go talk to Professor Leviton and grab ourselves. A lovely amount of XP. Let's do it. Caught 17 Pokemon. Lovely. Look at them all. Look at all these new guys. That's awesome. How much points are we going to get? 15 different species, which are brand new. 9,000 gold. We can upgrade our bag space, which you guys know I love upgrading my bag space. So we're definitely going to have to do that. Let's see how many points we get. We finish up with Koala. We finish up with anybody else? No. We got a bunch of newbies, dude, which is amazing. How much points do we get? We need 1,600. We got 520, so we're, we're a little ways out. So we definitely got to go back, backtrack, and catch a bunch of new Pokemon. And I might go catch a Chimchar. I think I, we can go catch a Chimchar and Turtwig. If I really want to. But we have to head over to this guy right here, and we're going to go do that right now. We're going to do, do that right now. We are 1,080 points away from actually catching a, or getting our next rank, which is a decent amount out. So I think by just catching a bunch of Pokemon, which, like, whatever Pokemon we see, I think we should just catch. I think we should just craft a bunch of Pokeballs, and we should get it after that level. But come over here. Oh, no, we have to go upstairs, man. God dang it. Hey, how we have to travel to like the 90th floor just to talk to Commander. But we'll talk to my boy Baggin right here. But like, yo, teach me. How much I just spent? 6,000. I kind of want to do two upgrades. Kind of want to do two upgrades. 7,000. Yeah, that's good. Two upgrades. Lovely. We'll do that. We shall do that. And there has to be like a max. I wonder what the max is for max. It's got to be a lot. I you can hold one of every item. <laughs> That'd be nutty. That'd be nutty. But we're on the second floor. We're going to head all the way to the top. There's a bunch of side missions here. But like I said, we're just trying to bang out the main story. And then when we do post-game stuff, we'll just crush the side missions. Crush the Pokedex. All that good stuff. Level up Pokemon. Do alpha Pokemon stuff. It's going to be awesome. But once I finish the uh, main story over on my uh, other account, we're going to be having guides up on this game. On how to catch an alpha Pokemon. Best way to catch shinies. Where to catch starters. Where to catch certain Pokemon. Rare Pokemon. All that good stuff on this channel. So subscribe. Stay tuned. Subscribe and stay tuned. But of course, as always, when we finish up a place, we got ourselves a little cutscene. And where else would we be? We would we be? Black can't speak. We would be at the Wallflower eating up on some lunch, munching down. Give me after it. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Let's get it, yo. Akari's so sick. I love that character. I love Akari. I love how they did it. Like that's looks like Dawn, but I love how they made her character. I just think her design's sick. She got that hair coming down. Mm bandana she just looks perfect for this game it looks perfect for this game just fits in the region and all that good stuff there we go we wake up in the morning stretch it out do a little what are these things called i don't even know but they're a good stretch for your arm great stretch for your arm hit up that and we got question mark dude do we have to go talk to commander come on i think we have to like that's one thing this game really messed up on is like taking us to an area and then making us walk all the way back to another one it's like yo get out my Ace, I'm not dealing with it. But this guy's like, yo, we got a new place for you to go to. The Coronet Highlands. And there's Electrode there. Electrode there, he's talking about. And Electrode is the next noble Pokemon with the, which we have to beat. And the Coronet Highlands is our next area which we have to go to. 
And it's a really cool place because it's very mountainous and you have to scale mountains and go through ruins and everything so i really do like that place and you unlock a brand new pokemon to ride on which is going to be sneezler and you don't really ride on him he climbs walls for you which is absolutely amazing it's like any any spot that you can't get to in a in a game you just uh climb up there with sneezler every game. So i really do like sneezler i think it's very very cool pokemon very cool pokemon and he's a cool type i think he's poison and fighting and you catch him over there. You catch him over there. And you catch a rare Pokemon, Rotom. I did catch me a Rotom, which is really, really dope. But we can't do anything until we have these Pokey levels. So I might have to do a lot of them off screen. I might have to crush a few of them off screen. Like I said, we can't do anything until we get to that next level. So we're going to go catch some new Pokemon. We're just going to go out into the wildland and catch a bunch of them. And I think uh, Battle Adman to demonstrate what you're capable of. Oh, we have to battle him? I didn't even... I forgot we had to battle this. Dude. Let's go battle him. I'll whoop on him. Where do we battle him at? Can I go explore first? We can battle him right here. Don't run it, dude. Run up. I think he just has like a leafy on. <laughs> and I have a Hisuian Typhlosion. Get this thing out of here, yo. We'll whoop up on it. We will whoop up on it. So yeah, it's leafy on. I've Gumi. Come on, man. All right, we'll see what Gumi can do. Or I can just swap the Typhlosion if I want to. Or I can just let Gumi go down. It don't matter to me. Combine's gonna poke out here. Level 36. This thing's calm mining right off the rip. That's lovely. Offensive stats for raise. Defensive stats for raise. This thing shot my offensive stats. God dang it. I'm just gonna let Gumi go down here. Gumi, you're gonna use uh you can use acid spray. How much damage can you do, Gumi? We should have went for a strong style shot. Gumi, give him the poison. Do him dirty. This thing's going for strong style later, Gumi. What's he using? Leaf blade? Could eat that up. No, we cannot. God dang! God dang. Run it up. Run it up. You, you wanna you wanna play games with me? Run this up. Run this up. You wanna play? Eevee's looking around. He's like, oh geez, yo, what is this thing? Run this up, dude. You want the smoke? I'll give it to you. Run it up. Get out my face, Leaf God. Don't need you here. Get out of here. <laughs> you wanna mess with Gumi? I'm bringing out the big dogs. Now Eevee's sitting here level 18. He's like, oh god. What have I got myself into? We'll get this angle right here. And we're just gonna drop another flamethrower. Yo, Eevee, do me a favor, get out of here. Oh, I hit my own guy. <laughs> Hey, my own guy, yo, and Typhoid's ripping, dude. Look at this, dude. He's huge. Dude's enormous. But his flames are sick. His flames are sick. We get a bunch of XP. Gumi gets none, though. Uh, Cleaver gets level up, which is dope. And, yo, our Basculin, level 46. God dang, dude. He's high. He's super high of a level. Super, super high of a level. And I wonder if there's nature mints in this game. I do wonder. I do indeed wonder if there's nature mints in this game. If you guys know, definitely let me know in the comment section down below. But here's my girl, Silene, over here. She's like, yo, Jeans, you cannot go to the next area until you're the next level. So get on top of that. Get on top of that. Or she brings it to the office. Your survey works. She wants to check it up and all that good stuff. Oh, um, you need four star. We already know that. I've been through this. Cool. So go do requests. Go do all that stuff. And we can get after it. I wonder if you get a... Uh, you get stuff... You get research points for doing tasks. There's some requests on the boards. Do bad eyes. A particular ponita. Come on, do this one. Claims you've seen a rather strange Ponita. Okay, right, cool. Uh, other ones. What's playing with Driftwind? I kind of want to see this one. I've seen, uh, have spotted a Driftwind playing with one of the village children. Mika in the survey court. Okay, cool. So there's a specific Ponita. And yo, look at my boy Rowlet. <laughs> I still pick up them. And we'll be out of here. So, okay. Let's get, let's get a move on here. We gotta go catch a bunch of more Pokemon. And somebody let me know in the comment section down below. Do research tasks or, like, side missions give you points towards the, what's it called? Give you points towards your uh, research level? I wonder. I wonder. I do wonder. But what I want to go do now is go catch a few few Pokemon. I want to go catch a Ponita. I want to go catch that giant Rapidash. I think we tried. Did we try it in the, uh, the last episode? I'm not sure. We're going to go to this Obsidian Field right here. And I'm going to go try to catch that. And I can show you guys exactly where to get Chimchar as well. So we can go catch ourselves a lovely Chimchar. Catch a few Pokemon over there as well. So let's go do that. Let's go do that. How many Pokeballs do I have? Need some more Pokeballs. Create 21 more Pokeballs, and we'll go here. And I want to put some stuff. Actually, I want green cakes. Do I have any green cakes? Do I have any? I don't think I have any green cakes. It's awful. No green cakes for G. So never mind. We cannot catch that Ponita, maybe. I could whoop up on it still. Hmm. Hmm. But we'll roll over there. We'll, we'll give it a try. We'll definitely give it a try. We do have Ultra Balls, which is awesome. And we need as many medicinal leaks as we can. So we'll go here. We'll catch some Sphinx and stuff. I don't even want to throw a Great Ball at it, but I will. 
God dang it. Let's switch our Pokeballs. Pokeballs! Onward, people. Can I catch you? Don't see me. Gotcha. Bop. There we go. Catch him up. These dudes are super easy to catch. Might as well catch them all. Gotta catch them all. And then we did not catch that Sphinx. God dang it. I really don't like this game. Cleaver, give me that. You know, I should have Gumi out here. Gumi, do it. All right, let's roll. Oh, there's tons of plants here. Tons of plants here. We'll take it all. We'll take it all. Where are the Pokemon at? I don't think we have Wurmple max out. So, you know what? We'll catch a Wurmple. We shall catch a Wurmple. Dude, it is pouring here. It is pouring. No problem. And what does the particular Ponita quest mean? Did we not catch that Wurmple? Why are Pokemon popping out of my stuff? I need to catch as many as I can. These guys are just doing me dirty. These guys are doing me dirty. Let's keep rolling out here. Babiril, Badoofs, and let me see in my Pokedex who I have, like, rocking out. Like, maxed out. Badoofs maxed out. Shanks. Wurmple is not. What do I have to do for Wurmples? Number of light specimens caught. Number defeated. So we can defeat one more. Catch three more. Alright. I'm with it. I'm with it. Where are these Wurmples at? Wurmples should all spawn over here, right? Hello, Badoof. We're done with you, Badoof. I do not need to touch any more Badoof. But if you complete stuff in the Pokedex, it is actually really, really good. We're getting research points. So we need to catch one. We need to feed a few as well. So hopefully we just catch that one. If not, we'll kill it. Cool. Dead. Any more Wurmps over here? Wurmple! There's more Wurmples. We need to defeat more. Where's my Pokemon at? Can I bring out my Pokemon? Uh, we'll just use Cleaver here. Screw it. Run up. Can this be a double battle, please? Or did that Wurmple run? It did not. I don't know if you can do double battles this long. Don't run away. Thank you, Wurmple. Stone and Axie up. Get out my face. Beal! Get out of here. So a bunch of research tasks. That's all we're going to be doing. Finishing that up. Where'd that other Wurmple go? Wurmple? There's some more Wurmple. Come here, dude. Come here, dude. Let, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Even though I probably should use, like, my Gumi or something, just rip up on it. It's fine. Your cleaver just rips her with Stone Axe. Doing them dirty. <laughs> Doing them real dirty. There we go. Take out that Wurmple. We can throw this here. And number defeat it. We need two more to defeat it. Two more Wurmples to defeat it. Come here. Hopefully we'll find one more after this. Because this will be lucky number four. We just call it our third Wurmple, which is awesome. We'll fight him. We'll just use quick attack. Because any move should kill us, right? Get out of here. Go on. Get him going. Get him going. Find me another Wurmple. Need one more Wurmple. We'll definitely find one like lurking around. Any over here? Wurmple? One more Wurmple. What might do that. I love finding the Wurmples. They just like squirm around. <laughs> Charlie's, we're done with you. We do not need any more of you. And I think that's all the Wurmples here. So let's go over here and catch some more Ponitas and see if we can catch like Alpha Rapidash. Could be lovely. I don't know if it spawns in the rain. We definitely will see. We will definitely see. Any worms over here? What we got cooking over here? No Pokemon? Nothing? Wait, what was that? Did I see something over there? It's Bidoof. God dang Bidoof. We don't deal with the Bidoofs well. We don't like them one bit. We don't like them one bit. We got this. And this is usually where the Rapid Ash spawns. I think maybe because it's raining. It's like, nah, some we, we ain't hanging out here. Probably. More Bidoofs right here. I do need to keep collecting all these medicinal leaks. They're really good for us. And I'm really low on them. So while I'm running around here, I might as well get as many as I can, you know? More Bidoofs. Looking for Wurmps. Where are you at, Wurmple? And I could just go straight towards the Chimchar. I know exactly. Oh, there's Wurmple. Wurmple, how you doing, son? How you doing, little boy? Little boy Wurmps over here. Come here, dude. Come here, he's keeping his guard up, and he's gonna be he's gonna die in just a second. Quick attack. Nope. Dead. Cool. You defeated Wurmple, and that should be it for us uh, killing the Wurmples. That should be that should be it for it, right? Could do Buizel now. I know there's plenty of Buizels over here, right? Let me check Buizel in the Pokedex. Weasel. Where you at? Level 7. So we had to catch a large specimen. Defeat two more. Uh, catch three more if we want to. I'm going to go defeat two more. Come on, Weasel. What you want, fool? What you want, dude? That was an awful throw. But hey, we'll take it all day. Weasel, you're going down. You were going down. Level 2. Oh my lord. That's why I love coming back to like the older areas here. You just rip up a Pokemon. Critical 8, you're dead. Any more Weasels over here? Need more of them. Okay, and the sun's out again. Weasel, where you at? Here's a Weasel. Come here. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, Weasel. Let me rip up on him. Stone Axe. Bop later. Leave or just tease off on people. <laughs> no problem. Oh, and he dropped the medicinal leaf. We'll take that all day. So there's that. And what was the other thing I had to do for Weasels? Hmm. Catch more. Uh, seen it use Aqua Jet. Have not. Number of times you defeat, you defeat it with an electric type move. Do we have any electric type moves? I don't think we have any electric type moves on us. But we'll take that. Uh, and now let's go catch that Chimchar. I know exactly where that Chimchar is located. So let's do it. If I go here on the map, and Chimchar is located over here. So 
No, let's just take the let's just take the foot. Cause we actually didn't explore this area. Let's see if we can get some new Pokemon over here. Oh yes, yes sir. Shinx right here. Bunch of new Pokemon probably located over here. Let's go. Let's do it. I thought I explored this area already, but must be my other account. Switch my boy Gumi. Get all that XP for him. More Wurmples over here. Why didn't I get that? Get that there we go. Let's roll. Hello, Wurmple. We're done with Wurmples. We don't even need to touch another Wurmple in, in this game. <laughs> Not another Wurmple. We just got a bunch of them. Add them to our XP thing. And we'll keep rolling out here. I believe an Alpha Snorlax spawns up here, too, which is really, really cool. Really, really cool. And we could go to a different place to catch a turtle, which is dope. There's Alpha Snorlax. I don't even think we'll catch this here, can we? What level are you? 45. Oh, we can. Oh, no, we can't out. He's unattainable. Oh, okay, never mind. We cannot level 45 though. That ain't bad. Anyway, was that an alpha Luxray? Is that a regular Luxray? I think it's alpha, right? Let me see your eyes, dude. He's regular. He's regular. You have a pump bean, dude. He's a regular Luxray. Eat up. Turn around. There you go. Go ahead. Eat up, dude. Munch, 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 munch. Yes, sir. Run it up. Run it up. Give me a Luxray on the squad. Oh, you son of a biscuit. Run it. Fight. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. What level are you on? 32. Oh, we definitely catch this thing. Going for Hex. Hopefully Hex doesn't kill. Yeah. Nice damage. Ooh. We're at that point that we... Ooh, ouch. We're at that point that we Pokeball. Yeah, we're going for it. Give me my Great Balls. So, right, we're going to have to save our Great Balls. Great Balls are going to only be for Pokemon that are rare and we need to catch. So hopefully we catch this first try and save, save some Pokeballs here. Let's go. Let's get it. Nice, lovely Lexray. Add him to the squad. Add him to the squad. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. It's a beautiful sight. Luxray's right there. Do we have a Luxio? Eat seasons anyway. I don't feel like dealing with it. Just for Luxio, we don't feel like dealing with it. Star Ravios, we already have plenty of them. We call it Luxray, dude. That's so good. That's so great. Throw us out here. Keep getting my stuff. And we're going to head across this river over here. Because if you head across the river... What is that? Abra, dude. I cannot catch an Abra. Abras are so tough to catch, actually. Try to actually sneak, sneak up on this Luxio here. You know I didn't mean to bring out Weird here. I'm gonna bring out like a orange berry or something. Come here. Switch my Pokeballs. Have these dudes go over there. Now I'm gonna catch them both. Oh, never mind. I'm only catching one. I'm only catching one. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Hopefully we catch that. Star Ravios. Something to catch. That'll be popped out. I heard him pop out. What is that, yo? That's a Kadabra. Hold up. Hold up, Star Ravia. Hold up, Star Ravia. I'm gonna have to kill you. Oh, my lord. I'm gonna have to kill you. Yo, there's Abras and a Kadabra over there. Abra Kadabra. I'm gonna have to kill this thing. And getting this grass right here. Because if I catch these things, that'd be amazing. Because they're a pain to catch. They really are a pain to catch. I think disappear. I see Kadabra. You don't see me. I lower you with a berry. No, there's more. This thing's just doing spawn stuff. Wow. These are so cool. Where are my great balls? Where are my great balls at? Catch them both. Catch them both. Abra call. Give me the cat, Abra. Oh, my lord. Let's go. Let's go. Two newbies. These things are such a pain to catch. I'm going to catch another one if I can. Actually, I'm going to try to fight one. I'm fighting this one. I'm killing this one. If these things are a pain to actually get into your Pokedex. You might as well just rip up on them. And when you have the chance, yo, get after these. Get a bunch of new Pokemon to the decks. I love it. I love it. I love it. Let's go catch ourselves this Chimchar, dude. That's so dope that we were able to get those two guys. Two newbies. Anything over here? What's that? Luxio? I don't really care for you too much. See, like, I'm not sure if we have a Luxio or not. Bug wards, more Luxios. Nothing new over here. Is that an Alkazam? It's an Alpha Alkazam. I should have known. <laughs> I was like, yo, is that an Alkazam? I was so ready for that. I was so ready to catch that. All right, but let's head across here because, like I said, oh, I don't know. We have Gastrons, don't we? What are these different forms? my pokeballs i'll catch you i'll definitely try to catch you back shot no it wasn't a back shot we caught shellos okay so hey i don't know if the forms count as different pokemon there we go i, I don't think they do because we caught a guy we caught a blue gash down but if you head over here this is exactly where we want to go because oh yeah there's apoms over here hi apoms do we have apom completed i'll actually check where's apom at we're about to finish up the episode we're about to finish up the episode. So we're going to be uh, maybe completing APOMs here. I can even find where they are. Okay, we do not. So catch two more. I catch two more. Uh, defeat two more. Number of times you've seen it leap out of trees. Number of times you've given it food. So let's give it some food here. Hey, APOM. Here you go. Happy birthday. Let's 
Ich bleib beim Bowser. Eat up. There you go. Can I catch them both? Apom, one catch. That one was eaten, so that one should be a catch. Yes, sir. Apom's getting the catches. And I call this island over here Monkey Island. Because A, there's Apoms, and B, you look down here, you have a lovely little Infernape. A Infernape right here, just chilling. More Apoms, but that's an Alpha Infernape. Can I catch him? But one and one only Chimchar spawns over here. So where is he at? We gotta find him, yo. We gotta find him. I see Apoms all day. Looking for Chimmy Chim. Oh, there's Chimmy Chim. Jimmy Chim. You know Barry. Beat him and hit him with a Pokeball. If not, we're gonna have to fight this thing. Catch it, please. Catch it, please. Let's go. Add Chimchar to the decks. Add him to the decks. Cool, cool. So now what I want to do is actually just finish up with these Apoms. And that thing's kind of scaring me right there. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm gonna ride over this way and I'm gonna feed these Apoms. Apom, I know you're hungry. Where's my Warren Berries at? We have plenty of these. We'll throw two. We shall throw two. Both you guys can eat. Both you guys can eat. Got you. Can you. Are you eating? No, you're not eating. You son of a biscuit. Son of a biscuit. Let me catch you, though. Let me catch you. A-poms are so easy to catch. So they're very easy, obtainable in your Pokedex and finishing up the Pokedex. Which is really, really good. So can I find a couple more? Oh, there's one right here. <laughs> there's one right here. It's an alpha. It's an alpha. More Shellos's. Staravias. I need more Apoms. Where's any more monkeys floating around here? I'd like to catch one more monkey. Where are all my monkeys at? What is that? Starlies. Oh, there's more monkeys over here. Monkeys. I love me some Apoms. Oh, oh, oh. Let me actually uh, check my Pokedex real quick. Go back to them. So, time to give them the food. We can give both these guys food here. We can catch one of them. And it's just three. We can defeat two. We gotta give both these dudes food. So, I want you to eat. And I want you to eat. Both you guys can actually eat. You guys don't like them? It's okay, if you guys don't like them, that's fine. Oh, both of you guys are going to eat that one. One of you guys are going to eat that one. That one ate that one. Here. Other one eat a citrus berry. And I had to catch one of them. Easy in there we go. Catch one of them and fight the other one. And kill this other poor monkey. <laughs> cool. Come here, monkey. Come here. Where are you going? Come on. Light it up. Run it up. And then we get the feet A-Poms. And we can probably get a lot of points for uh, for doing all this stuff. So we'll hex this thing. We'll probably kill it in one shot. And of course... Oh, it doesn't have effect. It's normal typing. I totally forgot. It's a normal type Pokemon. And he used a normal move on me. That's hilarious. Let's have a lovely little flamethrower. Let's take that out. And is there one more monkey? Because if we defeat one more, we finish up with our A-Pom quest. Which is awesome. Which is awesome. Let's do this. Or this. And look for one more, one more monkey. I don't think there's any more monkeys on the island besides you. Beside you. <laughs> Come on, please. One more A-Pom. One more A-Pom. I don't think there is. I don't think there is. If that's the case, we're just going to head back to the island. And we'll, we'll finish up the A-Poms now. We actually might be done with the A-Poms anyway. But there's one more mission we could have done. Just by defeating one more. So, let's head back. Let's go see how we did. There is a few other areas in this place that we did not even get to explore yet. There are probably a few new Pokemon. But let's just see how many points we get and finish off the episode there. And if we did not get enough uh, star points here... Uh, which I don't think we did. We'll actually see. We'll actually see. We got 4,000 things. I don't think we got to get 1,000 points here. But if not, we'll either do it in the next episode or we'll do it off screen. Let's see. We finished Apom, which is awesome. We didn't finish Wurmple, man. Wow, we did not finish Wurmple. That's nutty. We did not finish Wurmple. Get out of my face. 390, 490. Okay, so we're 590 away. We'll probably do a lot of it off screen and finish it up in the next uh, next episode. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know my videos go live. As in the next episode, we're going to be heading to the Cornet Highlands. Is that what it's called? The next area, which is the Highlands and finishing up and getting our four star ranking. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.